Hello my people, this is Monkey Boy back on Let's Play Minecraft. And today we've updated to the new snapshot. The new snapshot, it allows us new biomes throughout the land. And that's why my texture pack looks different. Because there is not a texture pack yet for the snapshot. And I didn't want to play with it at all. So we're just going to go real simple and go with vanilla. But we got some stuff to do today. Which pretty nice is I haven't done a whole lot of roaming around the land. But you know what? We got to shut off the old... Uh, the old bad boy, the old fireworks, we haven't been playing, have we? Tick a tick a tick. Tick a tick a tick. So, nonetheless, you know what that means. We got some work to do on the fireworks up here because some lazy fool ran the stone up the side of the tree. We're going to put that inside the tree. We're going to put it inside the tree. But, anyway, so what we're going to do today is yeah, we're going to roam the land. I haven't gone very far at all in this direction and because of that it's going to work out real good because the new snapshot is all the new biomes all the new biomes that they've added and we're going to go see what those are because I really don't have any idea so that's what you're going to do with me is you're going to come along and we're going to check it out together and see what we can find but first, I'm going to do a little work on the tree of life, and we're going to get all this sloppiness tucked away pretty. Press G to open your inventory. I did. It worked. I get an achievement. I'm a winner. Yay! I got I'm going to get this all tucked away, and then uh, I'll show you if show you what I did. And if it, if it ain't right, you just go ahead and say, you know what, you're wrong. And if it looks good, then give me a thumbs up when the video is over. Even if it looks bad, give me a thumbs up when the video is over. And subscribe to the channel too. You know, subscribe, everything, all that good stuff. Alright, let me get this fixed and then we're going to go roam of the land. Okay guys, we back. We got this thing all tucked in nicely. And I want to do more, I really do. But today it's not about, not about the tree of life. Today it's about exploring these new biomes with the snapshot coming in and see if we can be plenty prepared for the 1.7 update when it arrives so let's oh, let's just head on out where i haven't adventured yet is pretty much in this direction which direction are we going direction is the south okay so anywhere in the south we haven't gone yet now i i don't have optifine on here which usually runs everything a little smoother and these chunks are going to load in a lot slower on this adventure, so we might get a little lag and we might get a little chunk loading problem. But as long as we stay patient, we'll be good. We'll be good. Let's see if we can get going here. I, I know I've looked right over this, this ridge here. And the question is going to be... Oh! And I know I've fallen down this hole. The question is going to be anything that's not loaded before areas that i haven't jumped in yet now that should be the new biomes it should load new biomes when i when i load it when i jump in at this time now this is about the craziest thing i think i've ever seen I think it officially changed biomes right here because you see how it just flat cut off the earth and it started something new so right now I am inside the plains biome but if I drop off I bet I'm in the ocean let's see what this say this say we yeah we're in the deep ocean all of a sudden so that's where the biome changed so let's swim out here to the west and we can kind of see what what has happened now you can tell that it definitely has changed so to the right you've got what used to be the natural older biomes and now we're in a new biome so 
if I go on the perimeter of this, I'll eventually run into some land, and I think we'll really start to see the effects of, of some changes. But I'm gonna need an Aquafinity helmet. Right now, I ain't got enough, enough periods. Now look ahead of us, it, it spawned in. Look at all that. See, there's flowers up there that we've never even seen before. And it's gonna be a little ugly because you see how that hill or mountain right there has a straight cut down it. So it's definitely a change of a biome right there on that edge, I would imagine. Let's see what that biome's called. Wow, that's, that's weird. It's pretty awesome. We need to go up there and see how there it looks like there's a slice out this way and then on this side there's a slice out that way. So it's going to it definitely passes it together pretty pretty poorly. But I mean, what do you expect when you you know, mid game you change change something so dramatic like biomes. But I think this is going to be exciting and it's going to be really cool. It'll uh give us tons more areas to venture into. All right, let's see what we got right here. What are you? What are you? Pink tulip. Cool. So if we craft a pink tulip, that gives us pink dye. So that's that's new because before to get pink, you'd have to combine items with other other items. Let me see what we got over here. And we've got ourselves oxide daisy. And that'll give us like great. And that'll give us a spider. And I'm gonna kill you. Come back here. Come on. You you gonna drown? Alright, we're gonna climb up here. Oh. Now is this the same as something we've had before? Ooh. Now we've got a white tulip, so that will probably give us white, like bone meal. Um, doo -doo -doo. Let's see here. Alright, now we're getting up into a land we've never seen before. We're going to have to fight some of these fools off. So, this is actually... Get out of here. Let's see what biome we're in now. We're in a plains biome. So we've had those before. But within the plains biome, I think these are tulips, right? So there, this is a new biome, even though it's plains. It's got new foliage, new flowers. Oh, cool. What's that? Oh, wow. Look at all those. Hold on. Dude, get out of here. I'm trying to pick flowers. I'm trying to pick flowers for my mommy, and you're over here just picking all me. Alright, we're just going to get one of each of all these fun looking things here. Which, we're going to have to... Oh, you know what we're going to do? Oh, I got an idea. I'm not going to tell you, but you're going to have to check it out. Lilac. So we got a lilac. Allium. So we've got some cool stuff. Let's see what these craft into. Magenta. Nice. Magenta on both of those. Okay, so I guess there's multiple options for multiple options. And then Azure Bluette is also a light gray. So that's pretty awesome. And look, it goes to straight into a... It looks like transition is a little weird though. Because it goes straight into a desert biome. There's a creeper over here. He's snooping on me. He, I mean, oh, see, I couldn't even hit the guy. Did it, it didn't even take damage on me either. Man, that's crazy. Well, some of these glitches, we're going to obviously be needing to work them out from time to time. Tons of flowers. Who are you? So, man, there are creepers everywhere. Endermans are, are just popping up all over the place. Now look down there. Now that's something that we're not used to seeing. There's some grass, some gravel, and and some sand all together, and it creates a really unique, awesome look to it. So that that is pretty, man. That's nice and exciting for sure. Let's go up here and see. You know, Minecraft full of blocks and plain, you know, plain features to it. 
Doo -doo -doo. Getting a little, little better. Getting upgraded. Now we got something up here I want to check out too. What is this thing here? This thing is a rose bush. Sweet. So we got, this is red rose, I think. And then you got, or red tulip, and then you got rose bush. So that's good. I'll just, I'll fight you right here. I'll fight you right here. Come on. Oh, you don't want none of this. That's right. That's right. Holy shit. Where are you? You better not come back. I'll kill you this time. Where are you? Mm-hmm. White tulip. Oh, I hear you. Oh, is that you? I got you. And I've got myself three ender pearls. That'll help a ton. Okay, so this don't go very far, but I want to go all the way around here. See, that is so awkward how it just sliced it right off. There's definitely going to be a few transitional weirdness going on. We went to the edge of the earth, to the south, and yeah, we just found the little bit that I had shown you, and so now I'm going to go directly west, because I haven't ventured that way very much, and we will see what we can find over here. Okay guys, once again you see the transition of old chunks that were loaded before we went with the new snapshot. So you can kind of see it just got cut right off. And then you turn around and this is brand new terrain. This is a new biome. Uh, let's see what it's called. It's called Stone Beach. So this is a stone beach biome. Which I think it's... It looks quite interesting. I don't know if it's fantastic on my eyes. I think it's very interesting though. Um, if we go a little farther, let's kind of see what it brings us. Maybe we can use these steps to kind of get up high and see what we can find. I say go up there. I say go up, go up, go up. But you can also see how the heels are snow capped. So that's telling us, you know, that that's part of the new snapshot too. Because snow will fall. At a certain elevation now, instead of just being in a snow biome, you it will fall if you get up to a certain height, which I looked at it before in my in the SMP and it said 92. Yep, so we're on 92 right now. So if you go all the way up to 92, that's what you find. Now look at that. That is definitely a brand new view. That is, that is amazing. All right, I just took a little snapshot there. That looks really nice. And look at that, wow. Dude, the view is amazing. Let's get another snapshot in here. Wow. See this, the new biomes are just, they can be breathtaking. At first you seen over here, it just didn't look that great. But, but as you look at some of these other structures, it really adds so much texture and beauty to Minecraft, which makes it so much cooler. One thing we'll need to do is link our nether portal. We can put another nether portal in, and then we can get over here a lot faster, because when you travel in the nether, look at that. When you travel in the nether, you only have to go Yeah. Um, you only have to go a quarter of the ways to get as far as you need to. So, destroy those guys. Just destroy them. Wow. Look at that. Holy smokes. That's huge. Let's see if we can get up there. 
And we're up at cloud right now where our head is in a cloud. What's over there? There's some more injury guys. One already gave me a little workout earlier. So the clouds actually add, maybe we can get above this cloud. There we go. The ender guys, man, they're definitely out and about. Wow. What a view, guys. What a view. All right, let's see here. Let's go all the way to the top of this bad boy. Hope I brought enough food, because it sure drains you. Run around this stuff like this. I don't know how high we are, but I don't know that I've ever been in Minecraft that allowed you to go this high. Let's see, what level are we on? Yeah, we're on 154. That is way up there. Too bad there wasn't water. If this was a just a sheer cliff, drop right off into the water. So you can see the line where chunks haven't quite loaded yet, but I want to kind of go where the green is because we've seen all this, all this stone, but I, I haven't, we haven't seen a creeper die yet. Good night. Oh, that hurt. Um, so let's head our way down to try to get that. Let's we'll see if we got some gunpowder from our buddy creeper. And I don't know if that's new too. If you saw the splash right there. That seems kind of new too, because I don't ever remember seeing a splash of of dirt or stone when you drop a long ways. Let's just ride this guy down. Yeah. Whee! Good times. Alright, let's go over here where all these mobs are. Definitely see some more of those flowers, so that's pretty cool. Oh, look off to the right. See, you'd never see structures like that before. That is really cool. Wow, okay, see, you guys need to see looking to get in the snapshot and, and kind of play along. It's just amazing, at just the inspiration that you can get out of a lot of the things we're seeing on here right now. Now these guys don't inspire me very much. They inspire me to shoot them a little bit. Headshot. Ooh, Ender guy made mad, so that's gonna be ugly. And then we got the creep. We got the skeleton, thinking he wants to play with us too. Oh, there's another one. Dude, these mobs are vicious right now. Can't afford to die out here, so. We're gonna have to go backwards. Let's go down a little bit. Try to get healthy again, get our bow back. Ooh, we dropped in the water right when I was going to hit him. Am I out of bows? No. I mean, out of arrows? Oh yeah, there's lag. I shot the bow, but it didn't register yet. Get some life back here in me. Okay. Get out of here. Ooh, I tried to hit him a headshot. Okay, now we've come across regular plains biome, but at least we've got um, some flowers here. And I don't know if you notice this, but grass is usually only one block high. And this grass is growing too high. And if you hit the top, it takes it all out. So, do I have any iron on me? No, I don't. But I was wondering if you could shear it down, and then you could take it with you and kind of use it as uh, helping decorate with the two high blocks and you can kind of see you're just like running through it so that's another new feature that's pretty cool okay let's kind of sneak through this grass see if we can hunt ourselves as sheep there's a weird color right through there what is it We've got jumbo mushrooms. The big dudes. Check it out. Wonder what biome oh look there's there's red ones and there's brown ones. 
So let's kind of see what biome. And look at those trees. Oh, wow. What kind of tree is that? Okay, let's see what biome we're in. Roofed forest. Huh. And these look darker than oak, because that's an oak. Let's see if this is a different kind of wood. What is it? Spruce wood, which it looks like spruce wood. It just doesn't have the snow type pine needle looking branches to it. Huh. Wow, we're getting a long ways from spawn, but this is this is cool. Definitely we need to see if there's anything else. I am so mad right now. I'm gonna punch the wall. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, guess what? Out of the middle of nowhere. I even thought I was recording. And I was so mad when you guys weren't able to see what just happened. I thought I was recording. I was gonna go get some iron because I wanted to use some some shears to pick up some foliage. And turn around, there was a creeper. Blew me up. I'm all the way back at spawn. I'm not exactly sure how to get back to my items. The chunk is unloaded, which is good because it should still be there when I get there. The only problem is because I wasn't recording, I'm not sure where I died and what my cords were at that point of death. So I need to uh, do a little bit of work here. I need to get myself suited and booted so I can go over there and get the items I lost. Okay guys, you really need to check this out. This new snapshot has got me a little jacked up. Like here is a chest plate. It's shining bright, but there ain't nothing on it. I just went and killed a bunch of skellies to get a couple enchantments going. Um, and look, right here, sword, enchanted, nothing. Nothing there. Golden chest plate, shiny, nothing there. Legs, nothing there. Boots, nothing there. So I'm gonna do one more. I'm gonna just gonna see. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. We're gonna take this diamond shovel. We're gonna take the first one we see and nothing there. So there's definitely a glitch going on there. I don't really know. Maybe there is something on there, but there's no words coming up. Nonetheless, I gotta go find my good items out of that area I died in. So I got enough. I'm gonna use some of my armor that I already had. And then I'm just gonna roll over there and see if I can get my items. Okay guys, we're coming up to a biome here and we see more of these. Maybe it's like the roofed forest or something. Um, right now I'm looking at my quartz. I gotta go to 2000 on the X and somewhere around between seven and 800 I think on the Z. Uh, but it looks like water over there on that direction. So I'm just gonna go straight towards the sun. I don't know if I'm gonna get my items back. Uh, but we were gonna give a shot. So let's see what we can come up with. Gigantic red mushroom up there. We're gonna lay down a bed this time and be smart because I'm dumb. Oh, and there's a new biome that you guys haven't even seen yet. This is. Let's look at it. It's like a birchwood forest. It's only birchwood. That's it. Let's take a look at it and see. Ooh. Yeah, birch, birch forest is all this is. Now see, I haven't seen a birch forest yet. A birch forest. Sheesh. I'm sure I've been running around that chunk and it's all loaded up completely now. I'm gonna keep going to this water's edge, see if we can find some water over here. I remember being on top of these kind of as well. Because it is kind of a roofed forest with... Yeah, I don't... I'm so lost right now. And there's a plains biome right there. I don't really recall going through that. Hmm. I 
Although this is very cool. I don't think I'm where I remember being. Okay guys, I think I found the area. I remember the, the little hill there with it's all bald. Let's see. If we go down, yeah, see there's ferns in here. I probably circled this too many times. And then I went down this way to try to get us some iron. And there's that iron I tried to get and there's my items. Yes. Come on. Be real to me here. Be real to me. Yes. Oh my goodness. I never thought I would actually get here. The worst part is, is I could die soon. That's for sure. Get the real shovel. What's wasteful? That's wasteful. How about dirt stum? What's this? Zombie flesh. Don't need it. There's some armor. Armor I'm not really huge on right now, but let's see. Don't need string. That thing's dead. Dirt's dumb. Here, let's get this shovel. It's probably the biggest priority right now. Flowers are nice to have too. I don't need this many arrows now. Ender balls. Nice. Okay. So we've survived this. Let's get out of this cave before something else spawns and kills us to death. Um, oh, forget it. Let's at least do what we come here to do or else I'm gonna be upset. We're gonna get some iron. Okay, we crafted some shears right up from that iron we just got. Now these are the things that are so cool. Look at the dirt. Now I just tried this and it just becomes regular dirt. So we would have to silk touch this to be able to take it and use it. But that would be awesome. Okay, what happened? Did it just make two ferns is all it did? Uh, I don't really need this. Let's see. Yeah, I just made two ferns. Now, the question is, can you stack these on top of each other by using them? That's what I want to know. Yeah, I don't know how that's going to work. Oh man, it'd be so cool to be able to make those. Shift, maybe? No. Hmm. Bum. Bummer. So just to see if I could stack these or if they would they would be that big whenever I cut them down and guess what I died and I came all the way back and there was no luck whatsoever well guys it's some pretty cool stuff definitely and these trees are nice and beautiful and the new dirt is interesting let's just go this way a little bit farther I saw some mossy cobblestone so I think this is just randomly out here in this biome. Check that out. You know, usually it's some sort of dungeon or stronghold or something and not like that. So really, really cool. Plenty of mossy cobblestone to use. Wow. Let's see what else we can find. This is probably my favorite. What is this biome called? Mega Taiga. Mega Taiga, man, is probably my favorite so far. This thing is really cool. It reminds me of, of the mountains. Wow. I lived in Colorado for a few years, and that's what it reminds me of. Even in the water, there's mossy. Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. Mm-hmm. Now we got some glitches here, so I'm not sure what's fixing to pop in front of me. Look like that tree had a spawning problem. A hovering tree. I really just think this is this dirt's awesome. This is beautiful. Something a little different, a little new textures. Still haven't seen any horses yet in these biomes. And look, we got another flower we haven't seen before. Uh, I don't know. All this stuff is so precious to me. Which flower is this? A blue orchid. That's beautiful. 
I like orchids. They're probably one of my favorite flowers of all. And it looks like these biomes kind of mix together a little better. Like in just 1.6.2, you've got sometimes a snow biome right next to a jungle biome. Ooh, all at once. What did we say? Ready? Let's do it again. Eh, fail. But you have, uh, ooh, got some wolves. Uh, you have a snow next to a jungle, but here it's transitioning just a little better. It's not necessarily a snow biome, even though you got spruce wood. And I haven't really seen a snow biome in the new biomes. It's more elevation where the snow falls. So maybe that's a complete change. Ow. Food. Good. I don't know why I keep jumping in one spot while I'm eating. Helps me digest, I guess. So where is this? Because there's Mega Taiga, and this is just a regular Taiga. But see, we got those two high ferns again, though. And then we're going to look at this one right here and see what it is. And then this, is this a beach again, or what is this? Stream Hills biome, so we're familiar with that. Hey guys, I hope you appreciated this episode. It's kind of cool to see a new new biomes on the snapshot. So uh, if you're interested, check it out. But remember, there are some bugs on the enchanting. Um, so be careful with that. If you enjoyed this episode, click a like. And don't forget, we're always looking for subscribers. Give me my bed. Later.